A solemn vigil tonight in Chandler for dozens of animals discovered in horrible conditions at a home. Now that home was billed as a rescue for special needs dogs. The owner of the rescue group, April McLaughlin, was arrested. She's since been released. Let's go live to Lauren Clark. She's in Tumbleweed Park with more. Lauren? Hey, good evening there, Linda. That vigil just wrapped up about 20 minutes ago, and organizers say this was a way for them to honor the animals while pushing local officials to do more for vulnerable animals. Animals are, you know, voiceless to begin with, and to find out that not only are these animals voiceless, but they're, you know, have so many issues. Heartbroken. The dogs that need the most help being treated this way, just, I mean, it broke my heart, and I wanted to do anything possible that I could do to help. And angry. I, I'm, I have so much rage. Like, I'm so upset, but I'm so angry. 100 people joining together at Tumbleweed Park in Chandler Saturday, all showing their support and grief for the animals at the center of an animal abuse investigation. Tonight, we've all come together to have a vigil for all of the all of the victims. Earlier this month, police say they found 55 special needs animals stuffed inside this 950 square foot Chandler home. Court documents describe squalid conditions with several animals suffering from open wounds and the bodies of five puppies discovered by police inside the freezer. Animal rescue you say a few dogs were euthanized as a result of their injuries. Police arrested April McLaughlin, booking her on over 100 charges of animal cruelty and abuse. The county attorney's office furthered the case back to Chandler PD. McLaughlin remains free as the investigation continues. In the meantime, people brought flowers, signs, and pictures of the dogs, demanding justice and change. This shows that we need stronger animal cruelty laws. Uh, and definitely get some laws changed. There's a lot of work that needs to be done, and we hope that this can kind of get that ball rolling moving forward. And I want to see her get justice. I want justice for the dogs. And Fox 10 has tried to reach out to April McLaughlin, but we have not heard back. Reporting live here in Chandler, Lauren Clark, Fox 10 News.